I saw your performance the other day at the premiere, and I saw you so emotional after the movie. And yeah. How? You, what is it like for you right now when you've done something so huge? And um, uh, it's a lot, you know, and there's a lot. Um, there's a lot on my mind, but primarily I just feel a, a, a huge sense of pride and um, and satisfaction, and I feel. Uh, uh, creatively fulfilled, which is a really great feeling, you know. Um, we've, we've, we've worked really hard and we've made great relationships, you know. It, it, it's, it is bizarre to think that 18 months ago I didn't know Richard Madden and I didn't know Giles Martin, you know. Oh, yeah, They're both yeah, such yeah. big people in my life now yeah, and, yeah, and, you know, it's such a weird thing, you know. These, mm. people I could, these are people I would talk to about anything now and mm. we made this thing and, you know, it's a big global thing potentially because it's about someone who's big and global and um, <laughs> and people seem to really like it and uh, that's really nice. And Elton yeah. likes it. Um, he even said that he, he thought it was him, kind of he forgot he was watching you I think he said the other day. Yeah. That's we, got the, we got the big man backing us up. We? we did, yeah. <laughs> yeah, yeah, yeah. 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 I think there's such an emotional sort of truth and rawness to what the central performance that you just get carried away in it. I mean, you know, I watch it and I think it's me. Do you know what I mean? It's yeah. so sort of like it's so honest. It's so true. It's like you're on that journey, and, and um, it, of course it's the it's the best uh, accolade and compliment we could have that Elton is completely carried away by it as well. But hopefully that's part of the success of the film. But it's it's kind of it's very dark as well. I mean, you're showing a lot of darkness, a lot of loneliness, drugs, sex, addiction. How, how important was it that we saw all these sides of Elton to both of you? I think uh, we, we wanted to make something that had integrity and, um, and we're very lucky in that our subject supported us in that and, and Dexter is a, 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 a tenacious, fierce filmmaker and, uh, and has very little fear and so He's, we've, we've achieved what we set out to achieve, and it was of paramount importance. Well, hey, so yeah, got that one yeah, over there. And thankfully, Paramount have been everything we could wish yeah, for in the studio yeah, because absolutely. it is the film it is. And if they hadn't supported us in that, it wouldn't be the film it is. Yeah, but without without the dark, there is no light. And really, we're looking at yeah. the light. Ultimately, we are. But in order for that to really shine. We've got to go to where it's where it's at its blackest. Yeah, it's like know, if it doesn't if it, if it doesn't have that 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 difficulty and that dimension, it might be sat. It might be it might be good to watch at the time, but it's like a bad takeaway dinner. It's not. It doesn't. It doesn't <laughs> fulfil you in the way that something wholesome does. You know, and I think our film is nourishing and wholesome because it has all those things. things. Hope so. And it has so. amazing costumes, obviously. Do yeah. you do you have like anything in, in particular that you really enjoyed wearing? Uh, I, yes, I, all of it, frankly. <laughs> um, I loved it. Uh, <laughs> the more of it, the better, and the less of it, the better. Yeah, right? yeah, it yeah. really was my approach. Yeah, you could Either be everything or nothing. nothing. <laughs> um, but so, but um, I love uh, I love our signature costume, that orange neoprene thing. I mean. With the horns. Yeah. yeah, with the horns. For my money, you know, uh, Julian, Julian Day, for my money, I, I think, deserves some recognition for his work in this film. It's, it's, yeah. it's stunning. Is it anything that's authentic that he has ever used himself? Uh, uh, so the diamond earring I wear in the rehab scenes is Elton's. He, he, it's the first diamond earring he ever bought, and he gave me it about a year ago, and so I wear it for all of the rehabilitation scenes. I think it's a mark of the man, you know. It's the, I, when, when that happened, it was so incredible. And I think what it was, it was like, you know, we all are on this journey, you know, we're, uh, through our own lives. And there's certain things that I have at home in a drawer that are personal to me. Yeah. Little bits of things and whatever they are, or, I don't know, a tie that I like, or when I, a significant, you know, how significant must be the first diamond, diamond earring. earring that you bought yourself as a young rock star yeah. starting out on this most incredible journey and to go here this is going to be more important to you now at this moment in your life to yeah. give that i mean that's an incredible not just an incredible gift an incredible gesture to understand the profound nature of what that thing is and how what it gives to taron 
as a talisman of of yeah. uh, uh, of kind of strength to be able to put that in his ear, and, and he knows that. And it's, but I would never give that away. I'd be yeah. like, no, it's it was an first diamond. Thing. I it can't give that away. He gave it to you to, to keep forever. Yeah, yeah. It's in my it's in my apartment in London. Yeah. Oh, nice. What a nice generous. thing. Amazingly generous. Oh, thank you guys so much. Thank you. Thank you. Really enjoyed it. What a nice thank you.